Yeah, there were thousands of people protesting in downtown Los Angeles this afternoon on this May Day 2022. The theme was essential and united for justice. It all started around noon at Broadway and Olympic. I just want to tell you, when we fight, we win. A rally cry for a sea of people in downtown L.A., including community worker Erica Schwert. And house cleaner Maria de Gonzalez. Both women live in different parts of the area. They do different things, but like everyone in this march, they share similar feelings. Estoy marchando por un mejor... She says she's here fighting for fair treatment because people like her and members of her family get unequal treatment in their workplace. And Erica Schwert. Do you feel a sense of disrespect? Always, all the time. For the undocumented, those marching want a pathway to citizenship. And for this group, their concern is temporary protective status, an immigration status to protect those who would find it unsafe to be deported. Marching were union groups, community action groups, demonstrators representing immigrants, and indigenous groups. A lot of people, like Maria de Gonzalez. She says all of her family works and all are suffering under unfair wages. She wants more. And so does another marcher, Miriam Estrada. I see your sign says it's time for 20. It's, it's, it's time for 20. Is that the minimum wage you want to see? Yes. 15 is not enough. 15 is not enough for the caregivers, even for the other uh, workers. 20 is that time. May 1st, also known as May Day, it has a history. It's how we got the eight-hour workday from, you know, the Haymarket riots uh, taking place. It's always been an immigrant day um, here in the United States. There's an equity still, there's suppression, there's, you know, uh, we're just fighting for equality for workers. Which is why workers like Maria de Gonzalez and Erica Schwert march. It feels great. It feels great to be amongst all the people that are supporting all of the struggle with workers and immigrants together. The march ended around 3 p.m. here at Los Angeles City Hall. The hope is that government officials that change and make laws hear their concerns. In downtown Los Angeles, I'm Hal Eisner, Fox 11 News. Susan, back to you.